shooting another video as always um yeah i'm doing a a review or a psa about these um uh, tomy link cables for sega 32x and uh yeah they're I've, they'll work but without modification um so I have a uh, Sega 32X and a Sega CD with the the Model 2 Sega Genesis, and uh, I hooked it up. It had a black screen, and I'm like, "What the heck?" So I unhooked the power, and you know, started unhooking stuff. And I noticed the uh, Model 2 Sega Genesis, the red light was still on, even though it was unplugged, and the Sega CD was unplugged. The only thing that was still plugged in was the 32X. And the 32X is an add-on for the um, Model 2 and the Model 1 Sega Genesis. And it doesn't have a power button, so come to find out, the... Let's see if I'll focus... Bring it over to the camera. Okay. The, the bottom left pin is a power pin. So I had to clip that out. And I heard about these, you know, kind of Chinese cables. Pretty sure it was made in China. Anyways. Yeah, so I heard about their no good far as right out of the box even even down here it says tested you know and the model 3 sega genesis doesn't support the 32x so i don't know why they have the model 3 and then uh if you notice here it doesn't come with this odd cable that's a a, a ground that i had to solder on um, so i just put flux on it and then soldered a piece of copper wire and wrapped it around to the other side to make a connection because um, I noticed the, the cable I bought from eBay a few years ago let's see all right sorry about that guys um, yeah someone just came into the room while I was doing a video so I had to cut it short <laughs> but yeah anyways like I was saying um, you know I had to take out the power pin so it wasn't supplying any more voltage and added a ground and like I said the the other one has a ground when I tested it with the multimeter um, and the guy online, I'm supposed to repair systems for him, so I'm not supposed to, um, you know, I'm not going to, you know, disclose who he is and stuff like that, you know, um, or his business, because it's not his fault. He bought a bunch of these, but apparently he bought, like, somewhere around 500 of these, and, you know, he didn't know. I, I guess he tested them, and they're all good. Um so just uh buyer beware but uh if anything uh you know uh, just let me know if you uh, have any questions or comments or anything and i'll see you guys next time